up, what up, what up, what up, what up? Today we're doing nachos, Mexican nachos in the house today, y'all. So it's time for another video. It's just me. Hey, guys and girls. So we're gonna get straight into it on this plate. I have red onions, white onions, garlic, chilies sweet peppers spring onions and i have some olive oil heating in the pan so i'm just gonna put these into the oil when it's hot and sweat them off slowly we're not gonna burn them we're just gonna swelter them sweat them they call it and get them all in yes 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 i hope everybody's well everybody get them jabango and everyone's doing right and nice and fine okay so we're gonna sweat these off guys okay so when your onions are swelted off, we're gonna add our mince into the pan. That's good, so. Come on, come on, bloody hell. <laughs> So we have some a regular size mints here, um, minced beef, so we put that in with the onions and break that down and we're just going to mix all that sweated seasonings into the mints, okay stir it all in good and even. Okay, now we're gonna add some seasoning. So we have some dried thyme. And I just sprinkle, I would say about a teaspoon, teaspoon and a half of each seasoning or to your taste, you know. So this is Badia Complete Seasoning. Guys, this Badia range, very, very good seasonings. Very nice, the Badia range, love it, yeah. Gonna put a little bit of Obey. Same again, teaspoon, teaspoon and a half, or two. <laughs> and then we're gonna put some garlic powder. I love garlic, so I'm a bit heavy with garlic, and remember, we do have fresh chopped garlic in the pan already. Okay, then this is another badea sauce. This is adobo, uh, uh, adobo, don't know how you pronounce it. Another very nice seasoning. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, so mix that all into your beef. Okay. So that's nice and seasoned up. And of course some black pepper guys, put that in, some coarse black pepper. Mix, 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 make sure all the seasoning is mixed in very well. Also add in one tin of kidney beans. And we're going to mix that in also. Here we have some Maggi liquid seasoning. A little splash of that. Very nice. And I'm going to put one vegetable OXO cube. And a couple of Maggi cubes. Okay. I also do add a little boiling water in there before I put the cover on to make it going on simmering, okay? So 
to mix all of that in guys this is such a quick meal um cost under a tenner very cheap meal it's like 2.99 for the mints and then less than a pound for the kidney beans and you've got all your seasonings and stuff and a couple bags of tortilla chips pounds each so you don't even reach 10 pound maybe seven or eight pounds so once that simmered down guys you can see look it's nice and juicy look at that nice and ready i've you know let the mint simmer you know on a low heat and cook through properly and make sure them kidney beans are cooked and all right we don't want no belly ache okay very good so now let's play top okay so we've got our tortilla chips and these are cool flavor um accidentally bought flavored ones but it worked out very well it tasted very very nice so put a couple handfuls of tortilla onto your plate okay and then we're gonna put some mints on top of the tortillas yes oh god the tortilla them spread out okay so pour nice helping of mints on the tortillas make sure them tortillas are getting some juice so nice when the juice soaks into them man seriously so nice the trick of this is to do a real nice tasty savory mints now i've got some chopped up cherry tomatoes fresh just pouring those on the top and also i've got some jalapeno peppers which are quite spicy ones lovely you know also on this if you want to make um cheese sauce you can actually make cheese sauce and pour over it as well and you can use sour cream if you like all of that and put some um, sour cream on top or creme fraiche or something like that um, guys I bought a um, mix ready grated cheese so I'm just gonna sprinkle that on top mozzarella and cheese mix as you can probably tell this is a voice over so I will give you a tip do not buy ready grated cheese it does taste nice it tastes all right but nah i like the real cheese grated okay so it's the first time trying this ready great business buy your real cheese buy two different cheeses or three and put it on the top and then um grill it yeah so we're gonna grill this now the ready great cheese doesn't grill as nice as the real stuff yeah there you go so we're gonna grill this and i'll be back there you go guys all nice and grilled up and looking delicious yes 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 Ooh, look at that look at that look at that mm -hmm. and i'm telling you when that mint juice soaked down in them tortilla chips it tastes so nice so nice honestly i do not kid you it's delicious yeah and next to that guys i've got some dip ooh, ooh. <laughs> here i am i'm tasting here i go hot 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 mm. nice man yep thumbs up guys give me a thumbs up give me a thumbs up don't forget to like share and subscribe yes so there you have it the divas mexican tortilla nacho extravaganza <laughs>
it is really nice try it very quick when you don't want to cook and here just to show you i've got a tex mix guacamole salsa thousand island all kind of dip and just some tortillas in a bowl nice to serve with that as well you can just dip your tortillas into that mix hope you enjoy hey beavers and dogs Oh, hey, divas and duns, what up, what up, what up? Hey, divas, oh, okay. Hey, divas and duns, what up, what up, what up, what up, what up, what up? It's time for another video. No, wrong, okay. Hey, divas and dons, what up, what up, what up, what up, what up, what up? Today we're doing a bomba club. Yeah. Are you local? 